New research tonight from the American Heart Association finds an irregular heart rhythm known as AFib is becoming much more common in younger people. The study of 67,000 patients found more than a quarter of them were under the age of 65, far more than previously estimated. Experts say these findings mean everyone needs to be more aware of the risks. Any age, atrial fibrillation has is known to markedly increase your chance of dying or having a major complication from it, like a stroke, heart failure. Dr. Joshua Greenberg says he too is treating more younger adults with AFib at Henry Ford Health, as in the study, they tend to have more risk factors. Those risk factors are sleep apnea, poorly treated blood pressure, um, smokers, people with prior heart disease, Greenberg says doctors are also better at detecting AFib, and some patients are discovering it themselves with their smartwatches. If you do notice that your smartwatch is saying that you might have atrial fibrillation, that you should go to your doctor, you know, for further evaluation. Many people with AFib don't notice any symptoms, but some do. People might notice they just feel fatigued, short of breath, things that they used to do, you know, weeks or months ago are no longer easy. Some people notice their heart fluttering or racing, even with minor activity. They might notice just sitting around, their heart rate is 110, 120 beats per minute. There are a variety of treatments available, including medications and procedures. Clearly, you know, what used to be an old person's disease, that's no longer the case. And, you know, people under 65 and younger have to be cognizant of the risks, the treatments and the diagnoses. Dr. Greenberg says they've learned it is better to treat AFib more aggressively when it's detected instead of waiting for it to progress. That's because treatments are more effective before the heart suffers that scarring or other damage.